parameter which we wanted that time and we had given it back from 1 to 3 terabyte. As for that, I think it can be reconsidered to have a depot over here. Number one. Why I am saying so? <coughs> High value items. It's like the people of this place. They can't book a car. They can't even book a freezer. Any high value item, they can't purchase from here. In fact, when I came on retirement, there was a facility we could even buy fridge and uh, washing machines, few of these clubs from the local market. There are some organized dealers. But over the time, that has vanished. So this is not very quite uh, uh, beneficial for the excellence. So that looks a, that needs a relook. Then coming to expansion of this country, slowly and steadily, there have been a you know, expansion of this campaign inside. Perhaps with the rush which is coming in, it still needs other expansion. Third thing, the very, very pertinent thing is what I watch. I'm still, pro I can consider myself pretty young perhaps. But there are persons who are pretty old and there are also widows who are coming. We must immediately provision cards everywhere the cards are there. Because what is happening in the parking place is somewhere and People carry Kailas me in a road lake. To take it to their you know, car or whatever is very inconvenient. Even I have also felt the same thing. When you have to carry, especially when I am collecting 10 bottles of liquor, my work, I am getting cash here. Why can't you have cards from the canteen service? These are the very basics I am telling, very basics, but yet very pertinent. Very pertinent. Similarly, coming to the stores available. There's, I'm, I'm not saying anything which will hurt the, uh, uh, the commanding officer, but we feel, because this is not my feeling, this is the feeling which I bought as a feedback. So we feel that the stocks are getting existed because of persons pilfering it in the sense, pilfered not by anybody else. Some people are coming with a card of others. The card is a valid card of some exercise. Ex but I think we need to be a little extra vigilant and strict. If the person, he himself is not there or his widow or maybe a dependent, authorized dependent, the goods should not be issued to them. And they carry in bulk. And persons who are decent enough when they come, a little later, they hardly find any stuff. This particular process needs to be brought and also needs a review. Coming to uh, ECHS, most of the points, there are certain points, but they have already been written. Uh, what I wanted to say is, one point, it is not directly linked to the ECHS, but it is very pertinent in the sense, uh, again with the intervention of uh, former Army Commander, this, friend, uh, this uh, Aram, Sanik Aram Ghar came up. It, it came up as Sanik Aram Ghar. Now, it is known as transit approach. No controversies I want to bring. It is being looked after by somebody. Somebody is controlling. Well, when it came, we had only given, the veterans had only projected that point that from far flung areas, when very elderly ex servicemen they are coming and they need a referral and they have to stay here for overnight, why do they stay? How much money they have to go and stay in a hotel? So that was the basic aim with which we very strongly given that point and subsequent to that this thing came up. Now, very sorry to say sir, most of the time it has been occupied by serving officers. When a very needy person comes and he has to stay, he is doing it. So I am not saying or I am not against. Yesterday I was when I was having the uniform, today I may not be having it, but I still consider it. So I am not saying that it should be denied to the serving officers. But what I am saying is, if there is a requirement, we can construct one more floor. Create a little bit extra accommodation. If that is constructed, maybe these kind of needy people can be. So that is one aspect of it. And there are few other points. Uh, one thing I want to just say. During that time, there are two organizations here, three organizations in fact. One is Indian Ex Services League, one is Air Force Association, because these two are government approved organizations. 
Well, you know, MOD has accepted and recognized this for all the patients are welfare bonds. Then the third one is at Bhubaneswar, typical, there is a war veteran officer association. So these are the three who should be kept in the mailing list of yours, which was there that time. So that any time you are visiting or any program is there or when you come, you want to interact with us, we get a proper message. And maybe the barrier will not be that much. So this keeping us in the mailing address, perhaps for the welfare, because any time we discuss about the welfare, you will get positive feedback from these three agencies. So that is my honest request, if that could be accepted. I think I have completed and few other points that can be stated.